I began recording these messages for the researchers, but I guess I'm doing this for myself now. I only found a couple of cassettes, so I had to tape over the old ones. I think this one is going through its 6-3 recording already. The boredom's really been getting to me. Out of desperation, I decided to break into the study library. I had to manually override the door system. You know, things are getting bad when you're resorting to breaking and entering just to read some of Philip's literary classics. By the time I get out of here, I'll probably be the most sophisticated drama technician in the solar system.
kids, this is mom. I'm sending you this audio tape so you can hear my voice. My days here on Titan are based on routines. Every day I go and check certain places in the base for broken things. If something is broken, I fix it. Sometimes I have to build something new. Like tomorrow, I'm going to build an extension to a platform in a very deep cave. Wow. That place is something I can't even explain. I wish I could show it to you. In my free time, I go to the gym to run on a treadmill. Oh, and I also read a lot of books. I think reading makes you smarter. So don't you ever stop reading. All right, now I have to go. We have a daily meeting with the others. I miss you and I love you very much. Bye. in the hydro needed urgent fixing. That made me forget about people at home for a while. It almost scared me. I don't want to forget them. I'm here for them. And even if I need to focus on my tasks, I, I want to remember why I'm doing this. I also wonder where Wassily finds these therapeutic methods. Drawing... Talking to yourself on a tape, disco cycling. What's next? Running naked outside?
Hangovers in space are not as bad as on Earth. The way things escalated yesterday was really, really weird. Mm. I thought I knew these people, but something made them completely lose control. This is well in line with Seifer's findings. Taping one's thoughts and listening to them by oneself could externalize the troubles, making them easier to handle. Today, I've not felt guilt from surviving the Europa incident. There are days when I can accept the fact that I couldn't do anything else. But then the pressure of publicity pushes me back into anxiety. I hoped I could just stay away from people, so I could forgive myself. After carefully constructing a timeline of the unusual behavior of the people here, since the piece of the entity was brought into the lab. I've come to a conclusion. The MRI scans and measurements of common hormone levels all indicate that everyone here is experiencing the same condition. Homesickness. The entity is affecting our brains, which leads to changes in our moods and desires. Everything's amplified after we brought the sample here. The people that have been closest to it have experienced the most severe Symptoms that were initially weak and varying have now coalesced and strengthened into severe homesickness. I think we need to get rid of the entity. I have studied the gravity beam, and I am fairly certain I can use it to destroy the sample.
bring that up. Like I said, there was nothing left for me in the crew quarters. But I felt too afraid to keep going. That needed to stop. So I blocked my way out. Now the only way to go is forward. where I need to go to end this. I need to face the entity. I could also climb out through the air runs if I wanted. But to where? To the darkness I saw out there a week ago? That truth my love. I know how this will need to end. I have to go down there and face that thing. The door has been open all this time. All I need I've been here, what, a year already? Of course I'm sick. I'm sick of everything. I'm sick of the ramen bars. I'm sick of the ramen beer. I'm sick of being alone. Oh, Patrick. I so miss Ethan and Jess. I miss the people I was here with. Even I and any stupid camera. I see the full couple, their cat, and... I miss life, Patrick. I just want to go home. Why would I be recording this? doctor's lighter in the study. Along with the limited power I've been able to generate from the access... Thank <laughs> you. 